Full Throttle. Full Throttle. This Last track on the album. Before the bonus tracks, anyway. If you haven't got a beer yet, this is the time. This is the this is the party. Let's get into it. Let's mosh out. This is when you got to get up off your seat, even if you're in your office at work. We don't care. Get up and just rock out. Turn it up. If you're driving a car, this is where you're. Uh, you just just go a little bit faster than the speed limit. And, uh, or if you're in Germany on the autobahn, just go as fast as you can. Flat knacker. Just get out there, get the top down, and turn the seat up, and just give it hell. This song, when we recorded it, it was a, a fair bit slower when we brought it into the studio. Ricky realised that we were going a bit faster and getting a bit faster. He, in the end, he just said, play it as fast as you want. This is the last take we did it with, and we just went up to about 250 beats a minute. Almost as a joke, we just wanted to see how fast we could play it. In the end, it, yeah, it ended up feeling awesome. The lyrics in this song... I wrote about the music. I had this riff and this this kind of idea, and this song sounds full throttle. So what else am I going to sing about apart from fast cars and going as fast as you can? It's a good ending track, I reckon. Just to say, this is this is massive. Yeah, it sort of leaves you wanting a bit more. I reckon. Thanks for listening. Come again soon. We have a little little halftime bit here to um you know recharge. Yeah, just recharge your batteries. Just or Laguda. Refuel, refuel your engine. Just check your coolant. Do your shoelaces up. Get you into running. And key change shop. Into <laughs> <laughs> running. <laughs> I'm You're drunk. <laughs> key change solo here. Big riff underneath it too. You can hear it's just ballsy. And you got a bridge in the middle of the solo. It's, yeah, it's sort of like a, it's like a in between the solo almost. Well, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Ben here is just going insane. He did this as a joke as well. We we're just rocking out in the studio, and what the hell was that, man? It we listened, worked. We listened back and thought we've got to keep that. That yeah, it was really, unreal. really has the, the full swallow. And I think you had to go back and relearn it once he just ripped it out because he didn't even know what he did. He just sort of like made something up and it was just unreal. A bit of cowbell there, just you know, bringing it back for one one last hurrah. It's always good. It's not bad. You probably haven't even realised, but this chorus is in the is in the key up. The start of the song's in the key of D and then it builds up into E when the solo comes in. It really kind of gives that foot on the throttle feel. You just, you just keep going with adrenaline and keep pushing harder and higher and faster. But if you play this song to the end and then you play it back from the start again, you really do hear that key change, eh? But when it's going, when it's playing, you just don't ever notice because it just happens. This outro was just, as we said before, it was, this was a muck around take. Let's see how fast we can play. So, of course, we had this stupid ending. And I think we were also just so happy to finish the take because we, you know, just were so buggered from it because it was so high energy and we were all just like, yeah, and that was the last song and we were just we were like, fucking de tuning yes. our guitars and yeah, just smashing stuff. And, and we thought, well, that sounds awesome, let's just keep it on there. So, good way, to end, good way, to, good way to end an album, I guess. It's yeah. Just sums us up, really, just going absolutely bananas. Chaotic, yeah.